Hello everyone, SoFlo Entertainment here with a review of The Amazing Spider-Man issue 16. This is Legacy 910. This is um, the crossover or tie-in to uh, Dark Web. I haven't been reading any of the Dark Web issues, only the Spider-Man ASM ones. So by no the last ASM, we knew that uh, Ben was had control of this uh, magical orb and he said he was going to go after Peter so this covers over to uh, where that's at and uh, it begins with uh, when Peter sent uh, Ben into the goo and then it goes back to where we're at and uh, pretty much Ben tells uh, Peter that he can't beat him and Peter says that what makes you think that so they just start fighting and everything. And um, Ben starts saying how he's got more tricks up his sleeve. And, you know, Peter's trying to figure out. He says, I don't know what you're up to, Ben, but it's not good. And then, um, but Pete, Pete, uh, Ben shows Peter that he has, um, uh, because Robbie and J. Jonah held in this um, in this sort of stasis. I forgot the word they used. But it's, oh yeah, limbo. He's got him in limbo, and then he's telling him he's going to send Peter there. But uh, before that, we turn to um, Venom is is with the uh, Goblin Queen, and the Goblin Queen has Hollow's Eve there, which is um, Janine. And she has uh, Jeanine uh, Hollow's Eve fight uh, Venom and she knocks him out. So I don't know what's going on there, but you have to check out Venom. But apparently Hollow's Eve and um, the Goblin, uh, the Queen Goblin, I forgot what she's called. They uh, pretty much have control of uh, Venom. So then we go back to uh, Peter and uh, Ben. And uh, Ben sends... Um, Peter into this limbo with this huge like octopus type monster and uh, and uh, Ben says when you open your eyes you'll be where you're supposed to be and so Peter opens his eyes and he's in the um, Daily Bugle office in his old get up but this time Jonah is like in the, is like a demon or something and there's all these goblins and everything there so the issue ended like that so um this uh, was written by Zeb Wells and uh, McGinnis did the, uh, I forgot his name. I know his last name is McGinnis. He did the artwork. And uh, the artwork was on and off, so it was kind of goofy, like a Scooby-Doo and other, and other panels. It was like, okay, so I wasn't really crazy about the art. Uh, stories just way out there, these tie-ins. I Like I said, I haven't been following any of the tie-ins, so if you want to know what's happening with Dark Web, I suggest you uh, especially go into um, X-Men. There's a Dark Web uh, tie-in there, and also for Venom. But as far as this issue goes, um, I'm kind of intrigued to see what's going to happen with Peter now that he's in this limbo, and he's in this uh, alternate version of the Daily Bugle with um, J. Jonah Jameson as like this um, demon or goblin creature so uh, we'll see how that works out um, I'm going to last issue I gave it B minus I'm going to give this one a C minus it was okay nothing great but uh, let me know in the comments what you think and uh, this is so flow out goodbye